this hydrogen tap. What we're looking at here is the second of two cells. This is an exact duplicate of the Widowmaker. The only difference is I haven't varied the spacing in it. What I'm about to show you is one of the unique properties of the Widowmaker. So first we're going to put the second cell in there and we're going to activate it. There's going to be a lot of bubbles come up, but if you look real close, you're going to notice that there are larger bubbles. Here we go. The bubbles are also spaced differently, and we have to run this at 5 amps to get this configuration. On the Widowmaker, right now, we will get the same output with 2 amps as we just got on this cell with 5. We'll let it clear for a minute. I don't know whether you can really see it, but the bubbles here are different. Again, this is a duplicate in that it's the same size and the same spacers as the Widowmaker. Anyone who sends me an email, giving me their email address, I will return send back a tracing of the Widowmaker cell or a scan. If you include a wise crack with your email, you will not get that. Okay, now what I'm going to do is put the Widowmaker in here. I kind of wish I had never put that name on there. You notice we're at 12.23 volts. Just so you can see, there's the two cells side by side, pretty much side by side. Now we'll hitch the Widowmaker up. Again, same spacing, spacer-wise, different configuration. And let's put it on now. I'm assuming you can see the difference. It's a totally different type of output and a lot of it. I turn it off for a minute. If you want to send me that email, you send it to John Aarons, that's one word, at hydrogentap.com. And I will send you this scanner image of the C 
sell. Again, this is the Widowmaker here. There is a definite difference. It's not the steel. It's not the thickness. It's the difference in the spacing. It's the way it is spaced. I'll turn, put it on one more time. What I'm going to do here, turn it off for a second. What we're looking at now is the top of the water with the Widowmaker in there. And I want you to take a look at that. Do you see all of that coming up on the top? That is really pushing up. Now let's try the other cell. Okay, I'm going to turn it on here. The action is different. There's definitely coming up to the top, but it's different. So that view there. Same hookup. As close as I can get it. Okay. This is the widow maker. I'm assuming you can see the same thing I can. There is a lot more action here. I'm going to turn it off for a second. There's so much hydrogen being produced by that that uh, it doesn't dissipate very quickly. I'm almost out of time. It's 9 minutes and 49 seconds into this video.